Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the drive pulley on your lawn mower, first make sure the engine has cooled. Next, you should remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting and close the fuel valve. We recommend performing this procedure with little or no fuel in the tank. Now carefully tip the mower on its side with the fuel tank facing up. Support the blades and use a 14 millimeter socket to unthread the mounting bolts. Remove the blades. Support the blade adapter and unthread the adapter mounting bolt. You can use a rubber mallet to help remove the adapter. Remove the woodruff key from the drive shaft if still intact. Pull the drive pulley away from the guard, unhook the belt, and slide the old pulley off of the shaft. Install the new drive pulley by aligning it on the shaft. Loop the belt on the pulley and push the pulley into the guard. Before you reinstall the blade adapter, replace the woodruff key in the drive shaft. Now align the adapter on the shaft and slide it into place. Thread and tighten the mounting bolt. Use a torque wrench to torque the bolt to 40 foot-pounds. Confirm that the washers are still in place on the mounting bolts with the cupped edge facing up. Align the upper blade and the lower main blade together Insert the bolts, then position the assembly on the adapter. Thread and tighten the bolts. Torque the bolts to 40 foot-pounds to secure. Return the mower to its upright position. With the repair completed, reattach the wire and boot to the spark plug. Open the fuel valve, refill the fuel tank, and your lawnmower should be ready for use. <laughs>